I'm kicking it back to 2001 with my playthrough of Jack and Daxter. Hope you enjoy the adventures through my childhood that I don't remember very well. Remember to sleep well, brush your teeth, and have a good day. So as far as I thought, we couldn't go over here, but there's other eco that we can use to unlock different things in the game. I don't know if we need them to go over there, but I'm gonna go over there and see what happens. If I can beat this area, then cool. If not, that's fine too. And yeah, I know there's like a, a boss area down the line, but I don't know, I, I don't know, we'll see. So my name is Brian Saviano, uh, sometimes known as the number one old person playing Jack and Daxter for your enjoyment here on Misty Island on the PlayStation 4. It is on the PlayStation 4. Okay, with the light bar and everything else, so this is a authentic experience here. It is not on the PlayStation 2, because that would take far too uh, much resources to figure out how to hook that up and play it. As cool as that would be, and it's also, uh, it would not be in widescreen. It would be in just a 4x3 display. Which basically means it would look like a, um, a giant square. So, you know what? That's probably uh, not ideal for you watching here. So, you know, it's all good by me, though. We'll uh, launch up over this way. There we go. I'm going to try to explore every little nook and cranny I can in the search for scout flies and other things here. Uh, you can wade through the water. You can uh, swim a little bit here, but you will eventually get destroyed by a, uh, a shark or something. Now this thing here, I feel like this is uh, a time. Okay, so that's not too bad. What is this? What on earth are you? Do I totally forget what you are? Yep, there we go. Nice. Okay. Um, I feel like I should be chasing you. I don't know what that is. Okay. Um. Cool. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Come on. Nice. Oh, so close. So close. Come on. There we go. What is that? Oh, it's the thing. Oh, it's the muse. Yes, it's the muse. Oh, okay. So that's what that was. I'm like... That seems very not familiar, but okay. Yeah, that's totally what that was. Wow. So I guess you can go to this area and, and defeat everything just fine. I thought maybe, be yeah, no. I mean, I, I guess it makes sense because he's like, oh, hey, my muse is over here and it's a whole thing. And uh, yeah, please go grab it. So I guess we can grab it and it's going to be all, all fine. Uh, there's some red eco over there. That's a spicy meatball over there. We'll see uh, if if that can be to our benefit here. I don't know where exactly to go, but, you know, whatever. I feel... Okay, I was going to say. I'm like, all right. Yeah, actually, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to start right from the beginning again so I can actually figure out where I'm going and not get too totally lost here and not get destroyed by this blue thing. Yeah, there we go. Nice. So, yeah, as far as I know... Oh, we were actually already where we needed to be. All right, sweet. Uh, yeah, as far as I know, we have all of our abilities. Jack and Daxter do not learn any sort of new moves or anything like that. They have the uh, same move set throughout the entire game. So keep that in mind if you want to. There we go. Nice. Okay, we'll go over here real quick. Those things do fall off eventually. That's noted. Okay, Red Eco, what does this do? I forget. Uh, Increased power? I don't know. Uh, there we go. Do not want to fall in the quicksand, that's for sure. So that over there is blue eco. Okay. So I need to summon the blue eco from way over here? Oh, I don't know about that one, man. That's going to be a, a tough sell, I feel like, here. Hold on. Can I uh, jump up here real quick? Let me jump up here. There we go. Okay, but there's another one I can use, right? Yeah, right over here. So I probably need to... Ah, uh, that's not what I wanted. I probably need to get all three and then try to basically do like a, a massive, massive run 
over toward this way, right? Let's try. All right, so over here. Yep, we do this. Right over here. Right down over here. I don't know if that'll do it. Uh, maybe. There we go. Ooh, wow. Look how smart I am, ladies and gentlemen. Look how smart I am. Bam. That's a precursor orb for you. Do the robot, Dexter. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah, yeah. All right, so that's 12. Cool. So that, that went exactly as I thought it would. So I can see why this would be very difficult for me to do as a, a young Brian. So I don't blame myself for not beating this game way back when. It seems, you know, that that's a, that's a tricky little area right there. So I don't know how I would have went about that uh, otherwise. That's not what I wanted. That's lit. Okay. Sure. I guess bouncing off of the enemies is not a part of the plan. Not something I should do. Even though I didn't intend on doing that, but whatever. Make my way through here. Avoid all you, because I don't need to talk to you anymore. There we go. Camera stuck. Always got to love when the camera gets stuck for no reason. I'm going to fall. That's fine, though. Cool. All right. So I don't need to go over there again. Don't need to really deal with you. Wow, that worked out way too conveniently. I don't technically need to deal with you guys, but all right, that's fine. There we go. There we go. All right, so I need Blue Eco for over here, but luckily it's literally right there, so that works out perfectly. Oh, this is a an arena. Hello, arena. My name's Brian. Oh, those things I cannot destroy. The uh, the the crates right there. That is a no dice situation. Actually, wait. The red eco might be it. Actually, is that it? That's not it. Okay. That is not what I need to do. Okay. Not going to work in my favor. I thought it might, but it's totally not going to. Um, what do the bombs do? I mean, I know they hurt me, but, like, still, you know? I figured they would, like, not do that eventually. I don't know. Uh, and are they going to keep coming? It looks like they're... Oh, yeah. Okay. It looks like they might keep... Step two. Okay. Well, sorry, man. All right. Um, thankfully, yeah, they don't spawn me too far behind. That's great. Yeah. It seems like they just keep showing up no matter what. Maybe I got to... Oh, he's new. Okay. So maybe there's some aspect to this I wasn't factoring in, or this is now new or something. I don't know. Maybe... Um, is this more power? Yes, it's more power. Okay. So it definitely is because they are one shot now. It's just inconvenient because all the other enemies here are technically one shot. So it doesn't make a difference what you do here. There we go. Nice. I need literally one more bit of health, please. One bit of health. Come on. Nope. We're good. We're good. Yeah. Oh, there we go. That did it. Nice. I don't know who was sending out... The sandbag's full of dynamite, but that's fine. Oh, that's where Daxter uh, bit the dust. Okay. So that's not cool. But hey, I got another precursor orb. So you noticed before, like it actually showed what the level looked like. Tonight's featured event. Uh, it showed what the environment looked like when we were first here for the cutscene. So you could actually see, like behind here, like all those things moving around in the background. It was pretty cool. Uh, this looks like a giant eye or an egg or something. A big scrambled egg of some kind um oh i was tonight's feature okay so this is where whatever enemy was chilling out here you know um okay not what i need to do all right yeah no you weren't all right so if i go into here again is that gonna re-trigger the whole thing no it's not okay cool oh but i need to get over here now can i just leave Yes, I can. Yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. Just get it. Go. Get it. Go. Get it. Go. Come on. Just spam it. Just spam it. There we go. Nice. Worry about the health another time. It's going to be quite all right. And I feel like I haven't found another scout fly recently at all. So that's not good. But also, I can actually go and uh, get those two precursor orbs from before. So that's good from uh, Mr. You know... <laughs> it, I'm like, uh, he, he talks. I can't even do it. He talks like this. Talking like that, yeah. That that's who I can.
talk to now. That's good, you know? That's very good. So, for you, hi. Ooh, that's an attack. I didn't realize that. Cool. All right. Um, there we go. Anytime I smack one of the blue ones there, is that a balloon? I mean, it's definitely a balloon, but, like, what is it? Oh, the textures. Oh, it's a low-res model of what the balloon should be. It's supposed to be a whole massive airship, but it is missing polygons, I think. It's not quite loaded in the way it should be. So it looks kind of wonky right there. It's probably probably not how it should be, but, you know, that's fine. Uh, was there something over here that I missed? No, we're good. Okay, cool. Do not spit the eco at me. Or I guess, no, that was kind of loaded in properly from what I could tell. Nice. That's fine. So, oh, there's the blue eco. That's what I needed for. Oh, can I make that? I don't know if I can make that actually, man. That's a, that's a tough sell there. Let's see. I doubt it. I very much so doubt it. Hold on. Oh, yeah, that's, that's a tough one. Unless there's another eco spot through here that uh, I'm not factoring in, which could totally be the case. I don't believe they're hidden inside of here. Nope, it's always green. Okay. So getting to that one would be quite a pain, and I have zero recollection of any of this. So this is all, all new territory here. Not a single clue what I'm technically supposed to do here. Um, I don't know if I, I must have made it to this part, but I feel like I could get the 20 precursor orbs without going here. So maybe I went here when I was younger and I didn't quite realize it, like later in the game. Because I remember spending a lot more time in the early parts of the game very frequently. Uh, not so much with the, uh, you know, the, the later parts, just because, it, you know, it just doesn't resonate with as much time I spent with the game, I guess, you know? So, and I guess, like, you know, all these parts are fairly, it, it, it's seeming fairly easy. So it might have just been because I was younger. I was like, you know, I guess, uh, I guess it just seemed more difficult back then. I don't know. You know, it's still early, for sure, but, you know, uh, these things here are gonna totally mess my day up. Oh, they actually don't spawn out more of those as you get closer. That's good. That's very good. All right. So they're like, all right, we get it. Give it a break. It's done. Oh, that's the whole reason I came here was for this. I forgot. It's the entire reason was for that cannon. Well, I guess the cannon's good. I uh, don't need to worry about that anymore. So, could I somehow fire myself back over there? Uh, that might actually be what I have to do. Uh, but I really don't want to leave yet. Can I try? What, is it? what does it do? What, what do I do? Oh, I can destroy something. Oh, right down the middle. Oh, wait. What if I go... Do I destroy the base? No. That's what it was for. Okay, so... Is it for anything? Uh... Oh, it's for those things! Oh, those! Yes, of course! It's to explode all those and get all the precursor orbs out of them. Oh, okay. I getcha. Alright. Oh, I gotta launch them super far. Oh! And I can charge it up, too. That's good. That goes way too far. Okay. Uh, that's way too far as well. That's perfect. There we go. Perfect. Money shot there. Money shot right there. That should do it. Yeah, there we go. All right. Nice. I thought for some reason I might be like, you know what? Nah. You don't need to do that. But yeah, no, that's good. That's perfect. So on my way out, I can grab all of those, which is stellar. And I feel like I can go back toward this way. Just dandy, dandily, I think. I think down here is, uh... Oh, yep, that's where I want it to be. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, wait, okay. Well, thank you, uh, Mr. Piranha Plant, for eating me. That's appreciated. So what I wanted to do was launch myself from that platform and go all the way back and find that scout fly, but it looks like I definitely overshot it by accident there. And it looks like they cannot go to any lower of a platform. Oh, that thing. Oh, that's what I need. Oh, to go on the water, yes. So that is the device that I will be using 
uh, later in the game to get to the uh, fiery part. So that's cool. And that thing, I don't think I can actually do anything with. The giant... Oh. Well, I'm dead here. Yep. Okay. Oh, I might actually be able to rob one of those guys of their machines. That seems kind of familiar. The fact that the game allows me to, to go to that level right there and be on the same, like, playing field as them, that kind of seems familiar. Maybe? I don't know. If you haven't figured it out, uh, most of this game I still uh, don't have any inkling about, which I'm glad. You know, I'd rather ha ha have it be that way so I can keep uh, the surprises coming for me, you know? Don't want to know every single little thing before I do it, you know? So this down here is it. Uh, I'm going to use this. And you use this a couple other times throughout the game. And you do not want to overheat this thing with a boost. I believe that is a thing you can do, so don't do that. And I'm going to grab these. There we go. So this is kind of like a training course in a way. Oh, I got to get each of these. Oh, wait, hold on. This is probably a precursor orb is doing this. Yeah, that, that, that seems familiar. Okay, because we can get to every single level and do the whole thing here. Yeah, just like this. Grab them right there. Yeah, that that definitely works. Okay. And, like, there's another precursor orb over there. Yeah, this, this is cool. Is there anything I can do to boost? Well, I can jump like this a little bit here, especially with R1 as well. We can get a little bit higher on the jumps there, so that's cool. Let me see what I can do down here. Yeah. That one might be a tough one to get to. I gotta hop over from one island to the next and do the whole thing here. There's also these bombs that were in the way there that are totally intentionally trying to mess me up, but they're not gonna work. Okay, so let's go over here. Yeah. All right, so there's that. Nice. The fifth scout fly. Yeah, we definitely get one from this. Where are you gonna land? Hey, buddy, you gotta land. You gotta get on my level. How about that? Uh, there's actually a really difficult section coming up in the next area. Well, not in the next area. The next area is a beach. The one after that is going to be... Okay, nice. Uh, is going to be a rainy sort of ancient water type aesthetic. I don't even know what you want to call it. But, like, that area has a level involving this that is very, very difficult to do. You have to, like, chase after different enemies and... Yeah, it's very wonky, so I'm looking forward to trying that one out again and seeing how that goes. So, yeah, all that's left is this one guy over here, and he's, I think, still floating around in the sky somewhere. We cannot get up onto this area here. Uh, there's not a good uh, jump height on it at all. And there we go, just like I had predicted. So, yeah, the next level seems very, very familiar to me. Not this one at all. But again, that's good. That's very good. So, pop goes the lurker. So, I'm gonna head back over here. I I believe that was really it for the area. I gotta find that last scout fly, which I remember is over here. There we go. Hop off of that bad boy, bad Larry over there. Okay. And you should be... Well, I kind of wanted to go over here, right? Yeah, that's where I want it to be. All right, so up over here. It's like right up on a ledge or something, you know? Or I guess I'm traveling technically backwards now through the level. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, this is definitely not the boss area I thought it was, which is fine. But, um... Yeah, all right. So yeah, we're back kind of where we were finding the muse, the painter's muse, which I believe is a, a painting term for, it, that's something else. Not the specific name of the animal, like a painter has a muse typically, and it's not that, but I don't really remember, so whatever. So let me find that one, of the, well, how many are left? Oh, I have all of them except for one, which is the scout fly one. So you know what? I don't I don't feel like finding the last two scout flies. I'm gonna get out of here go back to the sculptor do that thing and uh, Be on my way here because that island took a lot less time than I thought basically an entire episode being there I I thought it was a whole massive fortress, but we got a lot of precursor orbs and technically We're close and we don't even really need to go down to the beach 
that whole beach area where the, the green eco was clogged and all that. We don't need to do that. Because especially with our really low talking friend. With that guy <coughs> with that guy there. Um he will give us two precursor orbs. We have enough of the um what whatever the, the eggs. We have enough eggs that we're good. Okay? That's a fisherman's hut that we have seen before. Uh Uncle. Oh, 90. Okay. So there we go. Forgot that it, he's the thing. Yep. We agreed on the thing. Here you go. Yeah. Cheerio, ta ta. Adios. Audi 5000. Meow, meow, my good boy. See you later. So there's that. Uh, I don't think we can exchange for more because obviously 90 is cheaper. Yep, cannot do that. And we can almost still get the, the two precursor orbs from before. So we're still good. And there's... Oh, is that the mare in there? And there's the last scout fly. Bada-bam. There we go. Cool. So I'm uh, right on track here. We have all the scout flies. We have all of the precursor... Not precursor orbs. Uh, we still need a couple here. Uh, there's two for the oracle. Wow. So yeah, we, we could really not go to that area. I totally am because that is a main point of the whole game here. But let me talk to the painter... Give the muse, and then I'll talk to that guy, the mayor, the actual mayor. I thought the, the green eco guy was the mayor. He's totally not the mayor. Uh, you're a bird lady. I forgot about you. So we still have to talk to a majority of these villagers. Didn't even give them the light of day, unfortunately, but I will do that in a hot second here. Yep. Just want to make sure. All right. So these three we have kind of been to. Uh, where is? Yeah, there's your sculptor. Hey, man. I have your muse. Whoa! Oh, the muse! You saved her! Oh, you really are the best. Here, take this power cell. I won't need it now that I have my inspiration back. I was calling power cells and precursor orbs the same thing. We have enough power cells to get to the next area. Uh, precursor orbs, we still have quite a few of them, but not as many as uh, I feel like I could uh, use right now. So there's, uh, for the oracle, and then the bird lady. I don't know what the- Oh, the mayor! I'm supposed to talk to the mayor before. Okay. <laughs> oh, what a wonderful sight! I thank you! The entire village can thank me. Uh, boys, you have restored power to the village and guaranteed my re-election. And for that, my boy, you've earned a power set. So we didn't talk to him once, but we did. <laughs> Shiny happy steeples. There we go. Uh, we did get it there. Oh, we could trade 90 for a power cell. We might as well do that. It's better than doing the 120 right now, save on power cell. So it just makes sense to do that. So that's perfect. So yeah, instead of spending 240 for the two from the Oracle, we're spending 180 for two. It's like a 30% off discount there. So... Not too shabby. That's by far my favorite animation of them getting the power cells there. That's perfect. So, and we could still go off and get one of our own from that guy over there. So, uh, we need to talk to Bird Woman. Uh, you're good there. What, what's my... Okay, so it's just a two from the Oracle. So, the beach is over toward the left. So, I should have gone there first, but whatever. Oh my, what a horribly sick little bird. You don't look so good yourself, lady. Oh, sorry. I thought you were a spotted orange-bellied rain friend. You know, yesterday I saw some terribly vicious creatures capture a mother flat flat near the beach. Now there's this poor little orphan egg sitting in a nest at the top of the cliff, and I can't get to it. If you could climb up there and push it off, I've piled some hay down at the base to catch it safely. Do an old lady a favor. And I'll give you a power cell. Well, we'll do that in the next episode when we go to the beach. We'll go to the beach. Beach, let's go get a wave. They say what they're going to say. So we'll go over this way toward the beach. All right. I want to thank you guys and girls for listening, watching, tuning in, and meowing it out with me as always. Uh, we're close to getting out of here, as a matter of fact. So uh, I will talk to you very soon for more Jack and Daxter here with uh, your boy, Bricks O'Brien. Peace out.